Go all the way to the ledge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go all the way to the ledge. Yeah. One more time. The same, but better. <laughs> like, just keep four in mind. Yeah, just shit like that. Yeah. yeah just... And then, uh, how about this? Okay, yeah. If you keep the, if you keep the idea that you're doing. Have you done a scoring thing like that where you're watching? Somebody skateboard and you're playing along to it? No, I never had the chance. It was great. It was unique because I didn't play anything until I saw the video and saw the tricks and saw the flow and the timing and the you know velocities of things. And so I didn't even start thinking about the music until I already kind of got a vibe for what the skating was like. I always say I feel like we're speaking the same language, so I would see something that he would do and the way he would do it, and it would correspond to my mm -hmm. my own approach, which was a cool experience. Have you? No, I haven't gotten to do like a reactive thing like that. So no, and then getting to do it offers like something that's so much fun. Again, it made it made it feel easy to to do because he's like he's just giving, it's like giving all these things. Yes. It's like this band has three guys and Rowan is the leader and we're making music with him live. now that we're talking about it because you know the sound of a, of a trick done well mm -hmm. it's, it's like the sounds are so satisfying mm -hmm. like the landing is solid it's like it has the scrape it's just like the sounds are totally part of the creative process mm -hmm. See similarities between skating and music, John Theodore? Oh, between skating and music, without a doubt. Yeah. I mean, there's the need to be totally sort of meditative and in the moment. Uh, like if you take your eye off the ball, there's significant consequences in both pursuits. And you know, predicting the way that nature is going to react or the way that you're going to react to this uh, construct, whether it's concrete or a ramp or whatever, you have to stay balanced and you have to focus and think things through in terms of almost like an arrangement, which I think is very similar to music. Stop. I think that's pretty hyper. That's like a, yeah, sick ending. It was, man, it was incredible. So much fun. The flow of it is totally musical and rhythmic and there's all this tension, building tension and release and setups and you know, it's uh, it's very musical. Yeah, and Rowan's got it's, it's sophisticated in his musical tastes. Um, so it was exciting to get to to be asked to do this, and also to kind of keep in mind what what keep him in mind, and then also just react to how he skates. And he's like, "There's coming. I, mean, I could watch this stuff forever." So it's interesting, yeah, because I I haven't met him yet, yeah. so I'm only reacting to his oh, he's dude. The, to the way he skates. Yeah, and he's it's a, it's a I mean, it's a great way to get to know somebody, you know? Huh. It's like listening to a record, I guess. That was just a, like, a, you know, why not get wild? You're a wild man. One thing.